Hey Carvers, another back saving tip today. I'm going to show you how I turn this motorcycle jack into a lift table. Stay tuned. Now the purpose of this project is to help save your back. You know, I'm a advocate for doing whatever I can to make things easier on my back especially when it comes to carving or moving heavy objects but this will really come in handy for being able to lower or higher whatever piece you're working on so you can get down towards the bottom or the foot of your project without having to be on your hands and knees with power tools or a chainsaw which could be very dangerous now obviously the first thing you're going to need is a high position motorcycle lift you could use any motorcycle jack but you're not going to get the height that you will from this high position one that i got actually it comes from harbor freight but i got mine on uh, i think craigslist some guy sold one for 150 dollars, so half of what you're normally going to pay about 300 for one but uh they're well worth it now really the only modification you have to do is to chainsaw proof this because we know what uh, metal and chainsaws do not mix all you have to do is attach some boards to these already drilled holes so uh, i just drilled countersunk and then drilled some bolts right through this frame so that the chainsaw will hit wood and not that metal. And uh, trust me, it's a step you don't want to miss. But you don't want to use good wood because the wood's going to get chopped up and ruined real fast. So you're going to be replacing these boards quite often. But it's well worth it. But don't go out and buy really good wood to do this because this table will you'll be replacing them quite a bit. This thing will lift. I think the max capacity is like 11, 1100 pounds or something. But uh, yeah, it really does help. I just went with these planks and you can see generally the length I have them. You know, you can customize it however you want. You could use a cookie if you have a sawmill or you just want to cut a cookie off a log, use that as your platform. Uh, you might just have to cut like a notch out to where the bar is. But you know, it's all about just protecting your chain from hitting the metal. So you want it to be thick enough to where you're not gonna cut through it super easy. And you definitely want to make sure you countersink those bolts because you don't want the chain hitting them because it'll dull your chain, mess up your chainsaw real quick. And it's really easy to use. You know, the turn knob just releases the pressure and it'll high, lower your, uh, your project. And then the pins are like a safety precaution. Another good thing about having the high lift uh, motorcycle jack is that it's almost even with the average tailgate. So you can slide your project right into your tailgate, uh, no problem. I even use mine as a portable workstation sometimes, but uh, with the handlebar in the back and even with the small wheels, it moves around pretty easily. Even through sawdust and grass and dirt and stuff, so. That's just a tip.